Hello once again, audience. When we left off, we just finished a terror mission with just a small wound to uh, torch our heavy, which isn't too bad. Um, and we got some promotions to take care of, so let's let's do that. All right. So, do we suppress or do we revive? I think that I usually am good enough to not let my guys get to where they're knocked out. If they're knocked out, they're... I mean... This is nice to have, but it's like you've royally screwed the mission up if this happens. Although, on the other hand, suppression is a lot of times a throwaway, but I feel like there's more oh crap situations that you want suppression. So let's do that. And psionics... Psy Inspiration or Psy Panic. Um, hmm. You're an Assault, so I kind of feel like Psy Panic might be better for you. Um, yeah, I'll take uh, Psy Panic for you, and then I'll probably take Inspiration for, uh, for whoever else. So, let's do that. Stuff we don't care about or need. Panic is decreased across Europe. Everybody's at a one, right? Should be, yeah. Yeah. Except for the stupid United States who left. Withdrawn. Alright. So, we go back to the barracks and look at the Psy Labs. We're still waiting for a couple of days to figure out if those guys are gifted or not. We're gonna get a council report before that. Incoming transmission. Okay. We are extremely impressed with the progress of the XCOM Thanks. project thus far, Commander. Your recent results were beyond our expectations. And that is not a statement this council makes lightly. Cool. Right. Remember, we will be watching. Let's, uh... Let's keep going. Let's see if we can uncover some more psionics. Flynn's back. Oh, O-Chang is gifted. My gifted heavy. Very nice. Very nice. He'll be going quite a bit now on missions. And now... Now that I have a heavy, I'd really like a gifted support. Let's test, uh, let's test Axel. And I'd also, because I don't really care about having a gifted sniper, um, a gifted second assault might not be bad. Um, yeah, let's throw him in there. Did I have any other... Did I have and uh, I can't even look at it now. I can look at my soldiers. But it won't tell me who's already been tested. Ah XCOM, don't don't do that to me. Alright, we'll know in a day. Sectoid corpses for money? Sure, I don't need them. I don't need the money either, but I'll oblige a country that wants to learn about sectoid corpses. No gift for Celis. Okay. Now we can add someone. We don't need more heavies. We, I doubt my sniper is going to be gifted. And I'm out of other things that I have leveled. Well, at this point, I guess I'll throw Rin in there, although I'm sure we'll get another mission. Should I even do that? This is probably going to be pointless, but let's see. Detected. I can just shoot this down. Still with the fusion lance, so there's less guys to kill. So I certainly don't need the salvage. Enemy is padlocked. And it's easier to do because you've got amazing range. Yeah, sucker. Eleven. Ethereal, Muton, Thin Man, Sector Pod Drone. Give me a heavy.
heavy, or give me a floater so that I can interrogate it. So, uh, at this point, uh, Ren is still in testing, although it's kind of pointless to, uh, kind of pointless to keep trying to test him. It just never works. assault. I've got a heavy. I would like to have a support, but everybody's a colonel or a squatty. <laughs> That's awesome. Um, and I've never seen a, uh, I've never seen a squatty, um, be psionically gifted. So, this crash site. So we have a crew size of 11, ethereal mutant elite thin man sectopod drone. So we'll be a sectopod and two drones, that's three out of the 11, taking it down to nine. We one ethereal, eight, seven, six, five mutant elites. Uh, we'll be three of those. And probably two groups of two thin men, something like that. So. Anyway, um, hmm. this presents me with some interesting opportunities. So interesting, it just put Ren back in by default. I don't really need Ender for this mission. Um, okay, how big is this UFO? It's a Scout Abductor class with an ethereal inside. Yeah, I think I only need, uh, I think I only need one sniper. Um, so, let's see. Is my other heavy in testing? Let's see, say no, he's, he's, uh, he's good. He's a friend instead. Psy abilities, it's my friend. Nice, so now we're really more focusing on these two guys. site for this operation will be in Canada. Operation Spectre it looks like the aliens Spectre. went down in a sparsely populated area. If there are civilians in the area, I hope they stay clear. Me too, Central. They will. They always do. It'd be actually kind of cool if they didn't set him in his cannon fodder. Should have. This is Big Sky. We're just north of the crash site. Strike one is in position to engage. Loud and clear, Big Sky. We'll monitor those readings from here. 
Strike one is authorized to assault the alien craft. I knew I goofed up. I should have put uh, Cisse in in uh, Psy armor. That's okay though. Let's see, where's my soldier info? His will is 93 anyway. And uh, who is it? Yeah, Ellis is my other, and her will is 123 because she's get she's getting the bonus. Okay, so it's putting me on the side again, but that's the front right there, and there's not a lot of cover.
wish I could get in there without getting poisoned. Stupid thin man. Let's, uh, let's go there. You will overwatch. making that noise.
this point, I think I can go there, um, or I can take cover right there, and hope that, because I need that poison being on, otherwise I would just run up there and take a shot at him, but I guess I could always go like there up against the wall. Just wait. Wait a turn. That might not be the worst move. Yeah, I think I'll try that. Stay there. Now can I how can I get everybody back up here? So that we can take this guy down. Now that isn't is that poison?
destroyed.
You can actually see that one. Well, that's not bad. Hmm. So, I wasn't even counting on you this turn, so you may as well take that shot. These three guys. One, two, three. Where's my other one? Right, because let's count. One man, two men, three, four, five, six. So basically, these two are the ones that I want to get a kill. this one, so that means I've only got three left. Mm. Well, I can do it with one, that's for sure. Because he can go up and blast one. Mm. We may actually end up needing a shredder rocket or something.
I want to come up this way just to make sure there aren't any more, but let's do a count. Three mutons, three thin men, that's six. Sectopod and its drones are nine. Ten, eleven, so yeah, I don't think there should be anything except for the ethereal and his guard. So we should actually be clear, but... I don't think we're alone out here. No, no, I don't think we are either. Okay, drone. You go there. Okay. soldier. Is it your turn to shine, buddy? I think I want to 
put you here. Shot. 
puts him down to five health. And I don't have anything that will not do, that, that will do less than five damage. That's the problem. Except for my drone trying to explode on him, but that's not going to happen. So, we've got to try to capture him twice here, and if it doesn't work, kill him. Right? What are our odds? Probably not great. Five health, 80%. Come on, go to bed. Sleep tight. Yes! Target disabled. Night. Alright, and now Alice can get over here. Probably get a mind fray off. Um, but I actually really like him too as well. You'd actually be my preference to mind fray. Okay, that was a good mission. This is a good mission. Captured the ethereal. Now I just gotta figure out how to mind control one. I figured the aliens would put up more of a fight. <sighs> They didn't look so tough this time around. No leveling for my... for my psionic guys. That sucks. Well, probably next mission. Thanks for watching. Um, join me next time as we probably get two psionics levels and uh, get closer and closer to the final showdown. It's been Solemn Dark signing off.